Already it is a given that the artist's work has very little to do with the artist's intention. So many aspects of what can be made have to do with other systems that are in place that precede the individual's desire. One more black test, and then Trina can see it. Catherine's really hard at work. I want to look at the viewer's impulse to associate the artist's hand or presence with their output, even when that relationship is clearly tenuous. So one of the things I've done a lot is allow um, other people to have a heavy hand in my work in ways that are more pronounced. For example, um, here with this printmaker, I've asked them many times to make the decisions in relation to what that print would end up looking like. How do you think we should lay down the colors? And um, what's the history of how these types of decisions are made? So often what I'm making is in conversation with fabricators that have knowledge of these histories and that have their own ideas about how um, those types of processes uh, Signify. Looks amazing. In the works, I'm trying to find as many places as possible where I can evoke the agency of other people, whether that's fabricators, the presence of the viewer, or sometimes it's maybe the people who have worn the costumes that sometimes are used. When you begin to see all of these influences, you somehow start thinking about the artwork as a collective space. <laughs>